Hi all! Today let's all learn about ecology, noise pollution, tips to reduce noise pollution. So let's start. Hmm? Why is it not happening? Okay. So ecology. What is ecology now? Ecology is a branch of biology concerning the spatial and temporal patterns of the distribution and abundance of organism, including the causes and consequences. Now, next, what is noise pollution, noise pollution first of all? Uh, I'll tell you. Noise pollution is a generally defined as regular exposed to elevated sound levels that may lead to adverse effects in humans or other living organisms. So the first point is saying is that when we hear very loud noises, our ears will not work then. That means after when after our ears don't work, we can't hear anything. We can just see and talk, not hear. So the next one is according to the According to the World Health Organization, sound levels less than 70 dB. Look, they are even saying less than 70 dB are not damning to living organisms, regardless of how long or consistent an expose is. So now next. Now, this picture will teach you what is noise pollution. So look at this boy or a person. He's sleeping in his bed and he cannot sleep because of the noise. So he's saying it's too much noise. <laughs> so at the side of him, it's saying airplanes flying over. <clears throat> Moving and honking vehicles. <clears throat> Industrial production noise. I don't know what is that. Music from this game. Yeah, 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 yeah. Neighbor's dog barking. Yeah, next. So, and in the second picture, it's saying a honking horn, honking, and a person closing his ears. Oh, I couldn't hear that time. Only I heard my noise. Ah, okay. So, how to reduce noise pollution? How do we do that? Okay, you are asking me? Let's just read it. Turn off appliances at home and offices. Shut the door when using noisy machines. So at the second point, it's saying shut the door when using noisy machines. Like I'll tell you an example, like washing machine, washing machine, use machine and vacuum cleaner. I think, um, yeah, and a lot of stuff, etc. So use earplugs like headphones, I'll show you. Like these headphones or more smaller than that. Lower the volume, not too high or not too low, just medium one. You can know you need to hear it, but not that big noise. Stay away from the noisy area. Yeah, stay away, definitely stay away from the noisy area because the ears will go away. Okay, follow the limits of noisy level. Control noisy level near sensitive areas. Go green by planting trees. So now you know how to reduce noise pollution. Next. What measures can be taken to reduce noise pollution? So the first point is we can reduce noise pollution by turning off appliances when not in use. Like examples I told you, washing machine, use machine, vacuum. So if you are not using it, please switch off it. Because when you are using and the sound is still going on, the neighbors near to you or not the neighbors near to you, or your friends will shout at you, what is that noise in your house? So next, um, <laughs> sorry, um, of appliances when not in use. Use of your play plugs, mm-hmm. And uh, lowering the volume, planting more trees, regular maintenance of vehicles and machines, etc. 
By controlling noise, we can control negative health effects that noise pollution has no on everyone. So next. Bye, everyone. Hope you got some intelligent, I think, um, points. See you. Bye.